Most people think of ghosts to be souls of the dead, wandering around aimlessly, waiting to be laid to rest, but sometimes they are thought to be more sinister than that. Evil spirits, also known as demons, possess people, causing harm of the possessed and the people around the possessed. Some researchers even claim that these evil spirits, fallen angels and demons, already control our world. Is that possible? Are our world leaders possessed by demons and fallen angels? Skeptics claim that this is the 21st century and mankind have moved on from evil spirits, ghosts and superstition. We now use logic and science. The trouble is, science is changing fast and new scientific theories like string theory and M theory talk of an infinite amount of invisible worlds in our own space and time. We cannot see them because we are not tuned into their vibrational frequency, but they are all around us. Some of these worlds would be almost the same as our world with only minute differences. But others, as we move farther away from our own frequency, could become more strange and alien to us. Does this mean that we are more likely to be contacted by hyperdimensional beings than interplanetary beings? There is no concrete proof at the moment that these worlds exist, although some people connect ghosts and other supernatural events to these worlds. More scientific evidence is that there are four fundamental forces in the universe, gravity, electromagnetism and the weak and the strong nuclear forces. Each of these is produced by fundamental particles that act as carriers of the force. The most familiar of these is the photon, a particle of light which is the mediator of electromagnetic forces. This means that, for instance, a magnet attracts to inhale because both objects exchange photons. The behaviour of all these particles and forces is described with impeccable precision by a standard model with one exception, that is gravity. For technical reasons, the gravitational force has proven impossible to explain microscopically. The question is, why does gravity not crush us? Some physicists now believe that string theory could have the answer. In the last few decades, string theory has emerged as the most promising candidate for the microscopic theory of gravity. The simplest way to describe this is that gravity is diluted by infinite different worlds in our own space and time. String theory allows for some very strange occurrences. We 
have no scientific theories like string theory allowing for infinite worlds in our own space and time, some physicists believe that dinosaurs would still exist. What's more is these dinosaurs could be in your living room. We cannot see them, feel them or contact them as they do not vibrate on our frequency. But they are as real as us. A world in which dinosaurs were not destroyed may lead to dinosaurs evolving into something very different to the dinosaurs that we think we know. In this world, dinosaurs would have had a 65 million year head start on evolution. In one world, they could be living in a super high technological world with technology and knowledge that we could only dream of. In another world they could be living in a dark, gloomy, dying, desperate world, desperate to escape. String theory could also mean that right now you are living an infinite amount of lives in the same space and time that we are living this life. If true, it must be the same for nature. This would mean that nature would have taken a slightly or very different path and would have created some very different life to the life we have become used to on Earth. These strange alien-like species could live in our own space and time and yet we would not even know that they were there. If string theory is true, these species could be literally thousands, millions or even billions of years ahead of us. A species this advanced may even have developed the technology to travel through these worlds and into our world. But even if these worlds that String Phoebe talks of do exist, what proof do we have to suggest that beings from different dimensions have been and are manipulating our world? 